Jermaine, when the staff or Bob or whoever it was comes to you guys and asks, hey, do you guys want to play in this tournament? Was there ever any hesitation? Uh, for myself, no. I don't think anybody else either. You know, it's an opportunity to get some practice with the team and an opportunity to play basketball. So I think it was a no-brainer. How much of the momentum from last week do you think you guys can carry over? I know Bob said a couple times he felt maybe you ran out of gas against Kansas, but but getting those wins, getting a little confidence, how much of that can you carry over to this week? Uh, this tournament is going to be a little bit different. You know, we'll have more days to rest, so I think we should be fully prepared and we should probably play our best basketball that we played the whole season these next couple weeks. You mentioned the most fun is it because Hugs finally gave you the green light. Been had a coach that's giving you the green light. It's just, just the way that coach coaches, you know, he holds everybody accountable. Since since I got here, I've been having fun on the court throughout all the ups and downs. So, like I said, I just keep try to keep my head down everywhere that I go and just work. Coach loved it. I loved it. You know, atmosphere and everything was just perfect. So you mentioned I think a couple weeks ago, this is the third place you've been in what three years. Yeah. When, when did it feel like I'm, I'm a Mountaineer? I'm a West Virginian. It's not something you feel right away. When did you feel that? Uh, probably after the first Kansas game. Really? Yeah, that was probably the biggest, biggest moment I've had in my career so far. That was kind of like welcome to, welcome back to NCAA basketball, but just, I don't know. I, I words can't explain how this year has been. Like I said, throughout all the ups and downs, I still had an amazing time. You know, it, as a transfer, your, your career is accelerating, and you got to get in and get going fast because you don't have much time. Here we go. And when you look back on it, was it was it how you thought it would go? Were you a little ahead of where you thought you'd be? Um, right I think I'm probably in the in the perfect place. You know, sometimes I like things to go a little bit faster, but I understand it's not it's not ever going to be like that. You got to be patient and just stick to what you're doing and continue to work every single day and get better every single day. So. And, you know, you were brought in to be a, a piece, a part of that, but basically it's turned into a rebuild. Now you're part of the rebuild. Does that change your mindset how you approach things? You know, like no. I said, uh, guys are just going to have to come in and work. Yeah, that's, that's it. You know, you can't be worrying about what's outside of basketball. You know, we let the coaches worry about that stuff. And we just come in and do what they say every day and work hard for them every day and each other. So. And this 10, the guys you got out here, that's your nucleus. So you, you got your, your blocks to build one, right? Yes. Uh, these guys, I think, yeah. I think we're building better relationships than we had at the beginning of the year. And it's just, we're all having fun. That's, that's the main thing. When we're having fun, we know that we can beat a lot of good teams. And I don't know if you guys have been seeing the practices, but just the, the attitude and the, the vibes during practice make it completely different. Much better? Yeah, a lot better. Do you view this as a um, as an extension of this season or the beginning of next season? What you're doing right uh, it's, it's kind of both, you know. It, it's an extension of this season because the season's not over until these games are done. Right? You know, we still got a chance to win some games and be champions. It doesn't matter what tournament it is. You know, we still got a goal, a new goal, obviously going into this tournament. But it, it's also going to help us going into next year, getting the more practices and stuff. You know? I know guys didn't want to just end the season like that and go home and, and just be working out and stuff. They'd rather be here with each other. So.